The wait is over for fans of Netflix's supernatural hit from the Duffer Brothers, Stranger Things. It's been nearly two years since the third season premiered on a streaming platform in July 2019, and since then, the streamer has taken its time mounting a mysterious marketing campaign replete with unexpected teaser drops and first looks. Finally, Netflix released the full trailer on April 12 for Season 4, which will roll out on the streamer in two parts, Volume 1 premieres on May 27, while Volume 2 premieres on July 1. This season will altogether have nine episodes. Plot details remain scarce for what to expect from the next slate of episodes, but Stranger Things 4 picks up six months after the Battle of Starcourt which brought terror and destruction to Hawkins. Struggling with the aftermath, our group of friends is separated for the first time, and navigating the complexities of high school hasn't made things that easier. In this most vulnerable time, a new and horrifying supernatural threat surfaces, presenting a gruesome mystery that, if solved, might finally put an end to the horrors of the Upside Down. The show brings back Netflix's beloved tweens played by Millie Bobby Brown, Noah Schnapp, Charlie Heaton, Finn Wolfhard, Gaten Matarazzo, and Caleb McLaughlin. They're not kids anymore, they really are full-blown teenagers, co-creator Mate Duffer told Netflix's Q magazine. That's why this season we leaned more into horror. We figured they should be in their own, version, of a nightmare on Elm Street basically. Returning guest stars include City Sink. Cara Bono, Maya Hawk, Brett Gelman, and Winona Ryder. But season 4 brings new cast members, as the Duffers enlisted Nightmare on Elm Street icon Robert Inland for a guest appearance that promises to be a really dramatic departure from any other Stranger Things installment. If we look back at our favorite movie sequels, whether it's Aliens or Terminator 2, Judgment Day, or The Godfather, Part 2. Or The Empire Strikes Back, the greatest movie sequels always do change it up. The tone feels different, Ross Duffer told Q. So that's what we've been trying to do each season to challenge ourselves and give everyone something new to try. Season 5 is expected to be the final installment for Stranger Things, and this season was split mostly due to the sheer volume of the story the Duffers had put together. Nine scripts exceeding 800 pages, two years of filming, thousands of VFX shots, and a running time twice as long as any previous season. The wait is over for fans of Netflix's supernatural hit from the Duffer Brothers, Stranger Things. It's been nearly two years since the third season premiered on a streaming platform in July 2009.